Di tuwing alas 6 ng uh, gabi ng Lunes, no? Uh, dadalhin, hayaan niyo pong dalhin ko kayo sa mundo ng mga arkitekto katulad ko sa mundo ng malikhain paggawa. Welcome to Peaceabilities here in CBRC.tv. Arman Benko po ang inyong lingkod. Kailangan po natin kumita-kita muna ng additional na income and wala naman pong income na dumadating ng wala kang ginagawa. Welcome to Legal Helpline Online kung saan sasagutin ng ating legal expert ang inyong mga katanungan na may kinalaman sa legality. So lahat tayo regardless of our status, whether we are an employer or an employee, kailangan sundin natin ng mga health guidelines. Welcome to CBRC TV with Tuesdays with Corey. Magandang araw Pilipinas, magandang araw online world. I am Jel Miranda and you're watching Expert Talk Online. Good evening, my name is Brother Castro Caliwara. I'm Arman Gutierrez. And this is False Connect. Buzz, Peace, and Beyond. Mabuhay sa bayan ng Pilipino. Ang wika, kultura at kasaysayan ay magintong sa gisag ng ating pagkapilipino. Ito po ang We Kasaysayan, programang tatalakay sa iba't ibang aral ng ating bayan. Good afternoon, Father Ben. Good afternoon, Sarah. Magandang hapon sa lahat ng nakikinig. At sa ating mga televiewers na gustong matuto ng mga livelihood programs at mga entrepreneurship skills na isi-share ng ating mga guests today. We're gonna talk about um, frontliners nurse stories during the pandemic. We are going back to the glory days of nursing. In demand ang nurses ngayon, hindi lang sa Pilipinas, kundi all over the country. May mga tanong ka ba tungkol sa inyong pinag-aralan? Bibigyan linaw namin at aming ikaw ay tutulungan. Dahil assignment mo, sagot ko. Ngayong gabi, marami tayong pag-uusapan. Interesting? Feel free to join us, message us, and we will try our best to answer your questions. Hello, hello there. Magandang, magandang, magandang gabi po sa inyong lahat. This is Simply Becky Mon. Ang programa po sa CBRC.TV kung saan pag-uusapan natin ang mga kwentong buhay-buhay nyo. Alam po natin na itong... Tala kaya na to ay napakaganda dahil ang real estate industry is isa sa mga industriya na napakagandang pagtuunan ng pansin. Sa ngalan ng Ama, na anak, na Espiritu Santo. Amen. Biyaya na ating Panginoong Isa Kristo ang pag-ibig ng Diyos Umat, ang liwanag ng Espiritu Santo, na way sumayin niyong lahat. At sumayin niyo rin. Good day, Luzon Visayas Mindanao. Welcome to Anyone Can Cook with Chef Cherry and Sir Chef. Mabuhay po tayo mga Pilipino. Sa panahon po ng pandemya, kailangan po nating mag-unwind at maging masaya dahil tayo po ang gagawa ng ating ikaliligaya. Hi, good evening, good morning, and good afternoon everybody. I'm Dr. Carl Balita and welcome to Bridges. Ito po ang bagong program ng CBRC.TV. Siyempre po sa pakikipag-ugnayan at pakikipagtulungan hatid sa inyo ng UST Alumni Association. I'm so good. I feel so good. Magandang gabi, Carl. At magandang gabi rin sa ating mga viewers. Without hope, resilience is nothing. So I believe that more than resilience, it is hope that we should be teaching our young people. Hello everyone, this is Evelyn Songko and welcome to Bridges. This is our show with CBRC Bridges. And of course, I'd like to greet our viewers. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. And I'm sure that you're going to enjoy the show today because we have many, many things to discuss. But before that, I'd like to introduce our co my co-host this evening i'm very lucky because now we have a new co-host um he's actually 
Dean Henry Tenedero. Dean Henry is actually the president of the Arts and Letters Alumni Association, and he is the chair of the UST Alumni Association, Inc. You know, Dean Tenedero is the dean at St. Clair North, uh, North Caloocan. I think that is it, North Caloocan. And his advocacy really is life skills for life success. Talagang bagay na bagay sa show natin si Dean Henry because his advocacy is life skills for life success. And you know, Dean Henry is very well known for his uh, multiple intelligences. He gives talks on emotional uh, intelligences. And it's my pleasure to introduce to you Dean Henry Tenedero. Henry? Can you greet thank our Thank you, viewers thank you, thank you. Well, thank you very much. The doctor song called my uh, professor when I was in college. And uh, the president of our UST <laughs> Alumni Association. To everyone who are tuning in right here, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. We will have an exciting topic, very timely and very relevant topic for you oh, tonight. Oh. Yes, Apaka very makaya. relevant, di ba? Yeah. But of yeah. course, we would like to greet Henry yung ating mga kasamahan, ang mga presidente ng UST Alumni Association. And definitely, we'd like to greet Carl Balita. Siyempre, yun yung aking co-host eh, no? at mentor ko yan sa Bridges. Oh, yes. Uh, okay? So, we greet all of them and yung mga alumni associations natin from the provinces, uh, from other parts of the world, um, binabati namin kayo, mabuhay kayo. Yung aming um, topic ngayon, very interesting. Na-interest ka ba dito, Henry? Oh, yes. Especially very, very timely. timely. No? Very, very timely. timely. Lalo't uh, sinabi nga ng IAPF na bawal pumunta sa cementerio mula ng oh, oh. October 29 hanggang November 4. <laughs> so, paano yes. natin isi-celebrate ang isang napakahalagang tradisyon oh, yes. sa buhay ng mga Pilipino. Correct, ating, correct. All oh, oh. All Souls Day, yan. All yes. right. So, oh, from Agustan, merong nag-greet sa atin, si Jovit. Wow, okay. hello Jovit. Just, uh, thank you, thank you, Dr. Carl. Thank you, thank you for manning the fort for the past yun, ating tatlong uh, Bridges episodes. Yes, ikaabang na natin ngayon. Sinimulan natin ang Bridges sa pagtatalakay sa kahalagahan ng values Mm -hmm. during the uh, Teachers Map mm -hmm. and World Teachers Day. Uh -huh. At sinuntan siya ng equally important na topic na pinangunahan ni uh, Dr. Nanette Fernandez patungkol naman uh -huh. sa retirement. Paano uh -huh. maging productivo sa retirement? At last week, okay, batang-batang psychology, ano ba siya, mentor, si yes. Dr. Kimpanar, patungkol naman sa wellness. No? Well yes. Very At pinabati uh, ka ng ano, ah, ni Carl. Yes, nabati ko na muli siya. At uh, thank you very much for this opportunity to be with uh, your dynamic CBRC TV, which is now, wow, all over all over the world. Ito ang klase, no? Yeah, yes. we're really very happy that uh, CBRC actually uh, is our partner. Diba? Partnership Correct. with the alumni. Yes, yes. And of Correct. course, we would like to congratulate them. Ah. And so, tonight, we will really talk about uh, Halloween. Siguro si Danica gusto rin niya yung Halloween. Nag-good evening and nag greet Interested ba ang ating mga viewers sa Halloween? Siguro mamaya sasabihin nila yan. And Henry, pwede ko na bang introduce ang ating guest speaker? Oh ah? yes, please. Uh, yeah. Dahil, uh, okay. dahil ang ating... Uh, oras ay napakaiklila. Yes, so, napakahalaga kasi yeah, 30 every minutes lang ito. Second, uh, yes, yeah, every, every second. Every minute ng ating uh, talakayan. Yeah. So, please introduce our eminent speaker. Yeah. Yes, of course, very special to. Uh, our guest speaker this evening is Father James Nitoliana. Okay. And Father James is the parish priest of Santa Cruz Parish Bagumbong, Caloocan City. He is also the spiritual director of the charismatic renewal movement in the Diocese of Navaliches. You know, 
Father James, ha? Father James is also an anchor in Radio Veritas. Naku naman. Wow. Father, so we're very happy that you are joining us. Nahirapan siyang pumasok kanina eh. Good evening, Father James. Yes, good evening, Father. Good evening. Good evening uh, sa lahat. Okay. Hello, oh, Father. Oh. <laughs> oh, yeah. Patingin mo naman, Father, yung mga alumni okay. natin na nakikinig. Yeah. Pati rin yung good mo- alumni. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening sa lahat ng uh, Tomasinos all over the world. Yes. <laughs> That is so true. Father. Father, background lang. Anong, anong batch ka, Father, sa seminary? Uh, I, I finished my STB 94, si Bishop Rex Alarcon. Uh, okay. The master of the order, uh, Father Gerald, this is my classmate. Oh, oh my wow. goodness. So, are we seeing the next Master General in the making? <laughs> <laughs> so... Father James, napakahalaga. Gaya na sabi natin kanina, pinagbawalan muna ng IATF ang pagpunta sa simenteryo dahil nga yeah, sa COVID-19. So, mm-hmm. medyo mababali muna sa dali ang ating uh, isang napakahalagang tradisyon sa buhay ng mga Pilipino yung pagpunta at pag, uh, pagpugunita sa ating mga mahal na yumaong mga kamag-anak, kaibigan, at etc. So, paano yun, Father? Ano, ano, uh, but siguro before that, tingnan muna natin yung, yung konteksto ng uh, Holy Week or Halloween. I'm, I'm sure okay. meron ano yan, technical story. So, doon muna natin simulan ang ating talakayan sa istorya ng saan ba ito nagsimula. Oh, yeah. Okay. So, unang-una, eh, babalik tayo sa 9th century, no? Uh, 9th century yung na uh, institute ang mahaba uh, yan ah <laughs> ang uh, all say actually all saints day kasi yung halloween or uh, all hallows eve ay ano yun eh uh, parang ano lang no uh, extension lang ng uh, all saints day okay so uh, in uh, during the 9th century uh, 837, 835, kasi hindi pare-pareho ang ano eh, ang uh, ang uh, mga findings ng historians. So we, we can say that 9th century, yung uh, institution ng Dies Omnium Sanctorum. Okay, ibig sabihin no, the Day of All Saints. Okay, 9th century po yan. No? Nung na-establish yan, eh, usually kasi it is a custom in the Catholic Church that Kung mayroong major feast, nagkakaroon ng vigil. So, ah. uh, uh, so pagkatapos ng Dies Omnium Sanctorum, which is Day of All Saints, nagkaroon ng Vigilia Festi Omnium Sanctorum. So, Vigil of the Feast of All Saints. Okay, so this is still 9th century. At uh, ano ginagawa doon sa vigil? Of course, uh, may mga masses no? and uh, offering of candles uh, for the saints honoring the saints and also asking the intercession of the saints. So, ito yung ginagawa sa uh, eve, evening ng All Saints Day or Dies Omnium Sanctorum. Kasi na yung century. At okay naman, no? uh, masaya mga tao dyan no? sa ano na yan, gawain ng simbahan. Then, uh, sa 13th century, na-establish naman yung, ano, yung tinatawag na Dies Omnium Animarum. So this is the day of all souls. So medyo yung gap nila, no? Uh, 9th century to 13th century. No? Medyo malayo, no? Okay, so uh, ngayon, itong uh, pag-establish ng uh, DS uh, Omnium sa uh, Animarum ay na nagkaroon ng epekto ito sa All Saints Eve, yung vigil. Kasi nga meron ng souls na ano eh, concept ng souls, no? Kaya, yung dati-rati na uh, honoring the saints and asking the intercession of the saints, meron na ngayon pumapasok na uh, remembering, honoring, and praying for the souls. Okay? Oh, okay. Uh, uh, pero so, yung, Father, ano... Hmm. Father, pag sinabi mong saints, hindi ba ito yung mga namatay na nasa langit na? Saints sila. Yes. Hindi yung mga santo na dinadasalan natin na may debosyon. So lahat, 
pag namatay, pumunta sa langit, sila ay tinatawag na saints. Tama ba? Saints. Yes, yes. Oo. Oh, oh. Yes. Uh, actually, okay. uh, itong, itong 13th century, meron pang isang bagong teaching na na-introduce. At unang-una dito oh, oh. ang ating patron saint, Saint Thomas Aquinas. No? Uh, okay. Isang saints naman talaga na saints na bine-venerate natin. Yes, yes. Uh-oh, Kasi si Saint okay. Thomas Aquinas, siya yung nag ano, nag-ayos ng mga concept, no, kay yung theology. So, ah, talaga si teaching, Saint Thomas, uh, ha? Oh, yeah, oh. yung kanyang uh, Summa Theologica or Summa Theology. Oh. A very very brilliant uh, prior, Dominican prior. Aha. Uh-huh, okay. Uh-huh. So, doon pala siya, uh, doon inayos itong mga konsepto na ito. Ganun yes, ba? Yes, yes, yes. Ah, okay. Kaya nagkaroon so, pag tayo sinabi mo, ng... uh, father na yung, nagkaroon ng element ng souls. Kasi ngayon, ang nakikita natin, ang pinalalabas kapag kamalapit na ang ating undas, no? They show scary movies, they show scary things, and then uh, we get a concept that, you know, the ghosts are uh, scary. No? Are everywhere. Uh, <laughs> Are yes. they saints or are they scary? <laughs> uh, in, princi- in principle, itong mga tinatawag na ghost, uh, ano to eh, spirits ito eh. Okay, spirits uh-huh. yan. And, um, well, um, itong mga souls cannot really hurt us except of course yung mga evil spirits, no? Kasi meron silang oh. uh, power eh, no? Kaya uh-huh. kailangan natin dyan ng exorcism. <laughs> or deliverance oh. no pagka meron ng evil oh, spirits oh. but uh, yung mga oh, oh. ordinary souls okay mga bothered souls no uh, they cannot harm us so actually most of them are asking for our prayers oh oh kung meron so, dapat, mga ganon yeah so dapat father kapag ka november 1 yan ay for them for the saints so we have saints, to yan, pray saints. for them Oh, 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 oh. Uh, no, no. And what uh, about the uh, November 2? That's souls. 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 Okay, so oh, balik ulit sa 13th century, St. Thomas Aquinas. Oh, oh. Sabi ni St. Thomas Aquinas, merong three states of the church. Three. Okay, one, oh, oh. tinatawag ni St. Thomas na Ecclesia Militans. The Militant Church. Ito yung church here on earth. Now, we are still struggling, oh, oh. you know, mm-hmm. battling with our Tayo enemy. Yun. We're the ones. Tayo yun. Yeah, oh. yung uh, church uh, militant or pilgrim church, no, sa bagong terminology, oh. pilgrim church. Oh. Oh. That's the first. The second is uh, Ecclesia Dolens, the grieving, the suffering church. Ito yung church in cleansing or in purgation. Ito yung tinatawag natin na purgatory. Okay, mm. ito yung mga souls na pinagdadasala natin. And the third mm. is uh, uh, Ecclesia Triumphans. The Triumphant Church or Church Triumphant, ito yung naka, nagpa, nakapasok na sa langit. So, mm. ito yung three states of the church. Okay? Uh-uh. So, uh, it, ito, yung, ito yung mga celebration natin eh. Okay? So, Saint, All Saints Day, mga saints, we honor them, we ask for their intercession. The All Souls, we pray for them. Yeah. Uh, eh, pero, Father, pero, eh, pero, 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 yeah. si Henry. Pero, Father, Henry. ang ating nakagisan talaga, yung aspeto ng takot, Diba? Kasi yung Uh-oh. bata, yung bata, kaya tuloy na associate natin tayo mga even mga palabas, pelikula or whatever, merong element of kata, uh, katakutan, no? Pero nung sinabi mo yung tatlong stages pala, ay napakaganda sana. So, hindi pala dapat negative o yes. pessimistic ang ating pananaw, kundi napakalaga. In fact, in fact, I was told, between the two, mas malalim daw ang kahulugan ng November 2, Father, All Souls Day. Yes. Okay, yes. pero ang ating uh, talagang binibigyan ng di ng pansin, tirik ng mga kandila, etc. ay November 1. So, yes. Okay. Uh, ang ano kasi dyan, yung intervention ng, ng, ano, ng uh, state, no? Uh, kasi ang state, ang estado, ang gobyerno, ang ginagawang holiday ay November 1 lang. So uh, people would go to the cemetery on November 1 is a holiday then uh, andong ginagawa yung mga bagay na for the souls for okay. the souls uh, uh, yeah yung that's one aspect yung kanina, Father yung sinabi niyo kanina na may vigil 
kaya ba yan ba yung practice ngayon na kaya pagka All Saints Day, nagpupunta sa simenteryo sa gabi? Yes, yes. Uh, vigil of the Saints, no? Uh, uh -oh. Pero yung, ito, ang original kasi dyan, talagang for the Saints lang. Ngayon, nagkaroon ng All Souls Day, so meron ng pang, uh, honoring the Saints, at meron na nga yung ano, remembering and praying for the souls. So, talagang ah. nag-combine. Uh -oh. Oo. So, remembering, ay honoring, remembering the souls. Okay. okay. Yes. Yeah. So, other, Henry, ikaw ba, Henry, uh, nakapagaling ka? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Palagi naman ako ng dadasal. <laughs> Ibig sabihin, <laughs> Father, <laughs> uh, ang tanong ko, Father, uh, uh, kasama ko sa istorya, yung pagsasaya, inuman, <laughs> kantahan, <laughs> o yan na yun na lang, naging kultural na lang natin dahil titipon-tipon, reunion ng mga family. Pero ba siya biblical anchoring yung mga ganung uh, ginagawa natin ngayon sa pagpunta sa ating pagbisita sa ating mga mahal sa buhay na namatay? Um, okay, two aspects yan. No? Pag, pag sinasabi ng mga saints, eh, talagang we celebrate the saints. Kaya mga piyesa natin, mga saints yan eh. Usually, di ba? Uh, yeah. Peace of saints, ganito. Kaya merong-merong tayong mga meals, di ba? Okay, may gathering of relatives and friends. Pero sa souls, at talaga more on prayer to eh. Kasi mga souls, ah. they need prayers. Okay. Oh, oh. Well, of course, yung family gathering, that's also one thing na magbibigay ng kasayahan ng mga soul kasi nakikita nila na the family is happy. So, more or less, mayroong konting relief, relief yung mga souls in, uh, in uh, suffering in purgatory. But uh, more, more, more than that is yung talagang prayer. They need prayers. Pa paano, so, Father? Yes. Patihin natin sila, Attorney Dwight, nandiyan at binabati ah, niya yung mga okay. taga-Pangasinan. Oo. And si Monsignor, Ber si Monsignor uh, Bernie Pantin, nanonood din sa atin. O magparamdam yung mga tigasok sergeant, ha? At saka <laughs> yung mga iba pang mga alumni natin, magparamdam kayo, ha? Kaya okay. nga, nagbabati uh, sila. Oo, so, oh, bumabati sila. James, ang tanong ko yung sa mga, may mga taong hindi nakapunta sa sementeryo. Okay, oh. kung isa na rin natin. Pero sila yung nagdadasal. Would that be enough to say na yung sinasabi mong ipagdasal ang mga uh, kanila mga kaluluwa? Mas hindi sila nakakapunta physically sa sementeryo. Yes, yes. Oh, uh, like I said, the most important thing to do is to pray for the souls and offer sacrifices for them. So, uh, hindi, uh, hindi na kailangan na pumunta pa sa cemetery But if you can visit the cemetery, maganda yon Kasi meron yung tinatawag dating ano eh, indulgence. Oh, yes. Special oh. grace. Oh. See, yung But, indulgence? Uh, ang, ang problema lang. Yung indulgence para yun sa mga patay? No, no, yeah. Uh, the indulgence, para sa atin. Uh, ano yan, uh, Pwedeng apply yan sa souls in purgatory or pwedeng apply sa atin mismo. Uh, oh, I see, Special I gracious see. eh. Mm, uh, uh, oh. uh, punta na tayo dun sa Halloween and Holy Win, uh, right, Father okay. James. Uh, oh. okay. Yung Halloween, so, you know, yun ay kultura uh, na hindi atin, ano? Tama ba? Okay, ganito yan, no? Okay. So for a long, long time, the celebration was in Latin. Kaya mga Latin, di ba? Then, sa Scotland, they started translating from Latin to their vernacular. Yung All Saints Day or Dei Omnium uh, Sanctorum, ang kanilang translation ay All Hallows Day. That's All Saints Day. Ah. Di ba? Di, di ba yung hallow is holy? Di ba? Yung hallowed be thy name, holy be your name. Okay? Ah. So, yung All Hallows Day. Yan ang All Saints Day. Tapos, yung kanilang vigil ay tinatawag na All Hallows Even. Even is Eve. Tapos, uh, as time went by, uh, some words will be in drop. Yung all, tinanggal yun. Tapos yung S sa hallows. Tapos yung V sa even. So, instead of all hallows even, nagiging Halloween. Uh, okay. okay. All hallows. So, this, this, so okay. pag sinabi mong okay. hallow, hallow is holy. Okay, holy. Oh, holy. So, may aspeto na holiness or holy celebration yung Halloween. Yes, yes. Oh, that's okay, the original. So, uh, ayan na, ayan na. So, Father. Play, play, play with words or pero meron oh, pa lang oh. siya. Akala so, lang natin, yun. Halloween or Halo. 
Kasi yung oh, isa pa po, din halo, H-O-L-L-O-W-E-A-N, no? Very halo. Yes. Okay? Oh, oh. So, maganda yan kasi lalo ngayon, I'm sure marami mga panata na pupunta ng simenteryo na oh. dahil ito sa pagbabawal. Yung iba, marami na rin pupunta ngayon yeah, mm-hmm. before the, the 29. Yes, so, yes, yes. Maganda yung sinabi ni Father kanina na napakahalaga na hindi ka ba makapunta physically, ikaw ay nagdadasal at painti mong inaalala yung mga magandang gunitain tungkol sa iyong namayapang kamag-anak o mahal sa buhay. Tama, Henry. So, Father, pag sinabi mo Halloween, so it's really something holy. So, holy, yes. either you say holy, eh bakit pag holy win, ay Halloween, bakit yung mga sinusuot nila ay mga nakakatakot? Why are they okay. doing that? Because they're wearing so, uh, things that are scary. Ang nangyari kasi niyan, yung ating uh, church uh, practices na haluan ng mga superstitious beliefs. Yun ang oh, uh, nangyari. No? Okay. Uh, yung costume, dunning of costume, ano yun eh, uh, mayroon kasing um, superstitious belief na tuwing November 2, yung mga souls or even uh, December 31, yung mga souls ay lumalabas at uh, mm-hmm. hinahanap yung hinahanap yung mga kaaway nila, may kasalanan sa kanila, at yun ang <laughs> yung tatakutin nila. Tatakutin Henry, nila. lagot ka. <laughs> oh, Superstitious nga. belief po ito. So, ang ginagawa Hindi ng mga tao... Hindi ito ano? Oo. Hindi. Ang ginagawa ng mga tao, nagsusuot sila ng maskara para hindi sila makilala. Para hindi, hindi sila makulpeltahan ng mga kaluluwa. So, that's the oh, beginning. Oh, I see. So, so, so most likely... Yan, para hindi ka makilala. Para yes, ng mga the, kaluluwa. The, yeah, those who, whoever would like to see you will not be able to recognize you and visit you. Paano yan ngayon? Correct, we, cannot go to the, we cannot go to the cemetery. They will oh, visit walang, us. Walang problema yan. Al- alam mo, mauna oh. pa yung mga namatay natin mga kamag-anak. So sila ngayon, ang dadalaw sa atin. Yeah. <laughs> Nako, <laughs> ha? But you so, see, yeah, uh, yeah, it, what does it is possible? Yeah. Diba? What could be the possible. other alternative? Father, what could be the other alternative so that, uh, you know, the All Saints Day can really be emphasizing holiness, etc. Uh, because instead of scaring people, diba? Takutan eh, oh. I can see there were those images na mga maskara with, with uh, the devil face. Oh, or one Wait, with the uh, 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 what is that the the choked uh kaganda may mga may, may mga premium pa yan ha eh? oh so yeah the, the, yeah the, the more Wait scary them, you appear the more chances of and, winning huh? and oh. i think what is being emphasized now father is the is the evil spirit something which yeah. you mentioned earlier yeah yeah the sin- the sinister uh, element so, yeah. ang ano natin, we, we have to redeem that original meaning of Halloween. Kasi nga, yung Halloween holy yan is saints, no? Kaso lang napasukan nga ng uh, superstitious beliefs and uh, na, talagang very commercial na po yung Halloween. It's a big business, Uh-oh. di ba? Okay, yeah. so we, 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 de- we devise something. So, yung Halloween na word, bi- binabago natin para mapabago mm. na din yung concept, no? So Uh-oh. instead of Halloween, H A L L O W E E N. So may mga gumagawa ng holy win. Oh holy, yeah. Para may emphasize, may emphasize yung holy. Pero in, in Kabal- principle, Kabalala. yung, yung hollow at saka yung holy is the same. The same oh, yeah. yung, no? yeah. But for me so, personally, mga... yes, go ahead, Father. Uh, for me personally, as a Paris Swiss, ang ginawa ko, ginawa ko siyang Holy Wins. H-O-L-Y, Holy, tapos Wins, Winner, uh, in yeah. consonant with the Church Triumphant. Kasi yung mga Church yeah. Triumphant, yung nasa langit, nagtagumpay na sila eh. So Holy mm. Wins, the Holy Person Wins. He's a, he's a, yeah. He or she is a winner. Kaya Holy Wins. Yeah. And then, mo, that's, um, very, that's very powerful, ba? Father, huh? in, in the area of yeah. marketing. In the yeah. area of branding, uh, the, social marketing. Yung, yung sounds niya, yung sounds like yes. Halloween, but uh, different words and different meaning, right? 
and Correct. it's very theological. Holy wings, oh, oh. a holy person wings. And then, yeah. uh, kasabay dyan ay yung parade of saints, of holy men and women. Saints Oy, are holy yan. men and women. Okay. So, so March for saints, parade of saints. So may yeah. parade yeah. of saints, magandang ano yan, ano? Custom. Uh -oh. Can we do that uh -oh. also? Can that be a very good uh, recommended activity during this yes. time? Siyempre, not yes. during the pandemic, uh -oh. no? But in the future. Uh, yeah, we can uh, actually, even during this pandemic, around 20, 20 participants uh, pwede. Kasi yung uh, distancing, no? 20 participants, magsusuot sila, hindi nakakatakot, kundi yung saint, uh, saint's costume. Yung kasunod oh, na mga yeah. santo. Wow, Ayun. It's I very catechetical. No? Oh, oh. Uh, of course, ang, ang mag-participant dito ay yung pwedeng lumabas. I think 15 years old, pwede na lumabas eh. Di ba? <laughs> oh, yes, 65 years old. 65, pwede na. Bilo, oh, 15, hindi pa pwede. Oo, oh, oh. ang dami pa nating pwedeng pag-usapan, Father Henry, pero nauubusan na tayo ng time. Eh, yung so, ating nga mga viewers, hindi na yata na makakapagtanong niyan. Meron ba tayong itatanong sa mga viewers natin? Mukhang hindi na tayo makakapagtanong. Because there is another show, ha? Coming after us, ba na talaga ang CPR? Yeah, we were told na meron ng bagong uh, oh, oh, enter entertainment program mga, coming, in, coming in at 7 o'clock. So, importante, so, alam natin ngayon na ang ating November 1, November 2, these are really holy days. And that the yes. Halloween is really originally something that is holy, no? Remember, uh, remembering or honoring the saints, remembering our uh, dearly departed, and really praying for them. Yun yung mga elements na take home natin this evening. Father, baka meron kang message, final message mo sa ating ano, sa ating mga viewers, sa mga alumni natin, mga viewers, eh, pwede bang yung message mo, kantahin mo na, I know, you sing so well. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yes. well glory, glory to yeah. God, glory to God. Kahit, kahit okay. refrain um, lang, sige nga, Father. Yes, yes. So, sa ating pong mga Tomasinos, Tomasinas, no? okay, uh, sana yung pananapalataya natin ay lumalim, lalo na, Papasok na tayo sa 500 years ng ating Catholic faith in the Philippines. 500 yes, years. Yes, 500 okay. years. Oo. Oh, oh. So yung mga ginagawa sana natin ay talagang uh, kaugnay sa ating pananampalataya. So I'm thinking of this song. This is an old song pero may kaugnayan sa kamatayan at uh, pagpasok sa langit. Alam wow. ni Tinidero ito. Alam, uh, Ma'am Songko, alam niyo ito siguro. Here's the song. <laughs> <laughs> this is an old song, but very beautiful song. Kay hirap unawain bawat damdamin Pangakong magmahal hanggang libing Sa langit may tagpuan din at doon Hihintayin itong bato sa buhangin. Wow. Oh, sweet na wow. wow. Father, Henry. that was a very powerful song. Yung pintuan ko biglang bumukas. Oh my God! <laughs> Patay kang bata ka. Biglang bumukas yung pintuan dahil sa batong buhangin na iyong ilawit. So, ang wow. aking... Thank you so much, Father, for joining yeah. us this evening. We have so many insights. And uh, you see, uh, I think no, that your whatever sharing you had tonight will actually be our guide in the future. Yeah, thank you so much. And let us thank our viewers, Henry. Yeah, thank you very much, everyone, for being with us. Because we have a learning. You know, more doesn't mean more. Ang ating panahon kay Father James ay kaunti lamang, yes. but less is even more. Dahil napaliwanagan niyo tayo sa talagang kahulugahan ng holy, H-O-L-Y, W-I-N-S. Very good idea to to recalibrate the mindsets of our people. Yan ang yeah. ating layunin. Sa bridges, we are not building walls. Instead, we are building new knowledge, new ways of thinking, doing, and being. So we'll have yeah. more 
episodes along these lines that will connect to Martian, to Martians all over the globe. Dr. Evelyn. Thank you so much, Henry. Thank you so much, Father. Nanette and Fernandez and Dr. Mildred, thank you so much for watching tonight. And to all our viewers, again, this is Bridges. Here in Bridges, no walls. We only bridge learning, lifelong learning. And we bridge faith, we bridge hope, and we bridge love. Magandang gabi sa inyong lahat. Join us during our next episode. And our next episode will also be another interesting discussion. Thank you so much for joining us.